I'd like to buy two Powerball tickets. Two Powerball tickets. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Erica Rosenfeld and Justin Melkman took a quick trip out of their home to play Powerball. Well, it's Christmas and we never buy lottery tickets, so might as well do something fun for Christmas. Yeah, you gotta, gotta be in it to win it. And I, I play once every three years. Their plan, if they hit it big this holiday? We talked about getting a place outside of the city. Mm -hmm. Art supplies. Art supplies. Music equipment. Music equipment. Yeah. We popped into several storefronts. It's been busy, especially on Christmas Day and the day before. And found high hopes this holiday season. What would you do with $638 million? <laughs> I got to I gotta go back to Thailand. <laughs> <laughs> back to Thailand. Much warmer than it is here. Uh -huh, yeah, warmer and... Uh, Everything that's good, food and everything. What would you do with that much money? Uh, and uh, buy a house mm -hmm. and give to family members mm -hmm. and to friends. Mm -hmm. and so lots of houses for yeah. family, for yeah. friends, lots of houses. Right, lots of houses, yeah. Five games, please. I myself bought tickets at two different bodegas. I think it's a winner. And hoped for a blessing from bodega cat Katrina, who was less than interested. Thank you. Cool. Good luck. But at our second stop, this little guy did seem more into it. I'm betting there's a winner on this ticket. I'll have to remember to file an expense report on these tomorrow. Now, if nobody wins, and a lot of people around the Tri-State are hoping to win tonight, and this jackpot grows by another 100 million or so over the next couple of drawings, it will be one of the biggest lottery jackpots in U.S. history. In Brooklyn, Henry Rossoff, PIX11 News.